Ladies and gentlemen, Pakistan carries out more than 95% of its trade via the sea. The economy of Pakistan is therefore wedded and sea based, wedded to sea, to sea based commerce. Our vision of geoeconomics is built around Pakistan's ideal location to act as a hub of trade energy connectivity and integration between Asia, Europe, and Africa. Our security and economic independence on the sea makes it necessary for Pakistan to build international partnerships in maritime domain for developing the blue economy and preserving the security of sea lines of communication against the threats posed by terrorism, piracy, drug trafficking, human smuggling, and arms proliferation. Pakistan has therefore been playing an active role in the combined task forces 150 and 151 against terrorism, piracy, and other illicit activities. Pakistan, Na Pakistan Navy has commanded these multinational task force on several occasions with distinction. Given the enormity and global nature of the problems, cooperative and inclusive approaches will be required in the maritime domain. Ladies and gentlemen, let me conclude by once again commending the efforts of the Minister of Maritime Affairs and the personal interest of the Chief of Naval Staff for taking this initiative to organize the PIMEC and exhibit the best of Pakistan's maritime sector. I hope that this landmark event will provide an opportunity to meaningfully engage for the promotion of international cooperation in progress. I'm sure that the platform of the International Maritime Conference will be effectively utilized for in-depth in deliberations of the issues I have outlined briefly. I thank you all. Pakistan is in battle.